So anyway, we got a violin here. So, um, it's a quarter size violin. So what you want to do is you got these, the fine tuners. They don't go into the holes and mount on like regular fine tuner. Like this, they screw right. So <clears throat> if you're going to have a quarter size violin and you need to put these on, they look like this. And there's a little slot, so it goes underneath the string. The string goes underneath the slot and over the top and into the hole, and looks like this. So you see, and the little lip will sit right on the edge of the tailpiece. So you got this. This is how it's going to look. So you see that? String goes in. To the front here underneath into the slot over the top then it goes into the hole and the little lip sits so now in other words now when you press it push it down it's gonna put pressure on the string and then you can fine-tune it and that's the way it works so that's what I did was here I replaced all the fine tuners and then you're gonna want to take the string out and uh, <clears throat> see this you want to put peg dope on there which I put on there and this is stuff is great you could get this online metropolitan this stuff works good it's it's it lasts a long time you put you rub it on there which I already did and the pegs will not slip they really good then you won't get any slips and then any other thing is, you know, put your bridge in the right spot. You'll see, line it up with the inside F-hold notches. And that's it. <clears throat> when a, so on any string instrument, when a bridge, when the, usually you'll have a lot of, this won't move, this part of the board with the heat you got to keep it away from heat this part of the board has a tendency to go up and down so which would make the string heights different uh, but as long as you got the bridge in the right spot uh, it will play in tune and you tune it up of course but if <clears throat> the bridge bumps then then you're going to have to play in the board but most of the time it'll be good on any string instrument you know, um, except for guitar, you know, um, you know, cello, bass, um, you know, this will warp up and down, up and down, and then you have to adjust according to the bridge, as long as the bridge is in the right spot and the action's not too high, if there's too much of a dip in the board and the action's too high, you can't bring it down too far because it's going to hit over here, then you have to take the board off and straighten it and all of that. But just little dips and bends won't affect uh, the playing ability and the intonations. Uh, so that's it for today. Uh, so we're going to get on. We got a bunch of these violins we got to do. And we're going to get on with that. Okay, see you later.